Hi, my name is Coach Noon and I'm the head of the Hotel School in Galway Mayo Institute of Technology. There are a range of courses here in the Hotel School in GMIT. In particular, we have some new programmes at Level 6 this year. We have the Higher Certificate in Arts, Culinary Arts, Bar Supervision, Hospitality Studies, Business, Tourism. In the Hotel School, we would have 12 different training kitchens. We have two training restaurants, two training bars, and we would also have some specialist facilities, including a wine tasting facility, a wine tasting lab, and also a food product development lab. The majority of students will apply via the CAO website, and if they go to the website, they'll find details there. Alternatively, you can visit the GMIT website, where the Hotel School has listed details of how you would apply for all the courses. GMIT welcomes applications for mature students, and indeed is an IOT that will be recognised as offering many opportunities to mature students. Hi, my name is Heather Flaherty. I'm a Bachelor of Business Culinary Arts student, and I'm a mature student. I studied Bachelor of fine arts in Canada and I decided kind of maybe three years into my career that I wanted to follow my passion which is food. When I found out that GMIT does Bachelor of Business in Culinary Arts I was delighted because it's perfect. The workload is not difficult if you keep on top of it. In practical courses everything really comes together, all the theory and the practical that you've done. For example, the course that we're doing at the moment brings in together marketing, food science, nutrition, so you kind of get to work practically with the theory that you've learned. My name is Mark Shallow, I'm in second year. Our typical day is basically we'll have a production class or a practical class for three to four hours in the morning and then after lunch we'll have maybe three or four hours of theory class. Theory classes consist of computers and communications, systems and menus, health and safety, gastronomy. It's a good uh, balance on the course between the production and the practical classes. And I'm working at the moment in a restaurant in Milltown called Finn's on the weekends. Um, so if I'm offered a full-time position there, I might stay. But I basically filled out a form, went for an interview with them and they just said that, yeah, we'll take you on. College comes out to see you while you're on your placement and how you're getting on and you can report back to them if any you have any problems or if anything arises. It's hands-on, well-run, good lectures. College has the best facilities in the, in the country and there's a big industry out there, there's a lot of money to be made. You can really take this trade anywhere in the world with you, you know. My name is Victoria Hamsa. I'm a, I'm a student of GMIT. We do modules like restaurant service, accommodation, bar and food and beverages. We can do a la carte setting and I intend to progress into doing the block release in management and there is another course coming up, a training managers development. I hope to become an hotel manager. My name is Anne O'Leary, I'm the course coordinator for the Bachelor of Business Culinary Arts Level 7 program in the GMIT. So today we have your uh, three students and they're currently working on the module for uh, product development. So they have to come up with a brand name and a product name and they have to come up with a packaging idea and uh, then they present it as part of a showcase end of April. Their brief really is to come up with something that's innovative and new. Before Christmas we've looked at market trends. So the class over at the far side they're making empanadas. The uh, students here have the idea of producing ice cream cocktail. So it comes in a kit and you have different flavours. Well, the way the course is designed in year one and year two, it's 50% practical and 50% business and science. And then in year three, they take a specialism and the uh, weighting would be 70% business and 30% uh, practical. Health and safety is paramount in the GMIT. All students must wear a full uniform and that's provided by our in-house uh, laundry. Hello, my name is Valerie Connors. I'm currently studying Bachelor of Arts in Hotel and Catering Management in GMIT in Galway. I started my career path in GMIT back in 2000 where I studied professional cookery. I then progressed and I returned as a mature student in 2006 to do Bachelor of Business in Hotel and Catering Management. I graduated last November in that and I continued on to do my Bachelor of Arts which I'm currently doing at the moment. I got a placement through the hotel school in Le Manoir au Cat Saison, which is a two Michelin star restaurant in Oxford. And working there was the most invaluable experience I've ever had to date. My lectures are very nice. Everybody's extremely friendly. We work on a more one-to-one -one basis rather than lecture student, which is very effective. First and second year is extremely practical um, with production classes, etc., and restaurant training. However, in third and fourth year, it's more academic. You're constantly in the classroom. There's no practical in third and fourth year. There is no dress code in the college, except for when you're in practical. You've got a 
professional uniform when you're in the restaurant and also when you're in the kitchen. We've got a fantastic IT centre which you can see behind me. We've got over 300 computers here at the moment. We also have a fantastic library upstairs. Also we're lucky enough to have Wi-Fi within the college so for those who don't want to come to the IT centre you can sit down in the canteen, have a cup of tea and work away on your assignments. Everything you could want is there for you. It's a fantastic experience. It's hard work but it's all worth it in the end. Hi, my name is Anya Nocton and I'm a second year student in GMIT. The course is two years and then you can progress on to the second year of the tourism management course um, if you wish to further on for your degree. With my course there are many fields that I can branch out into such as working in heritage sites, being a tour guide, travel agent, travel counsellor. You have the chance to go abroad to many different countries as we're doing the language. One of our subjects is travel trade operation where we're doing a reservation system world span and that's all about taking people's bookings and like what they do as a travel agent. My lecturers, they know that I'd like to progress on to airport work and they've been very helpful in regards to telling me what I need to get there. My name is Jerry O'Neill, I'm the course coordinator for the BA Honours in Hotel and Catering Management in GMIT. I lecture in financial management and management accounting, which is a very important part of the management of any bar, kitchen or hotel. In all our courses we have placement um, opportunities and in the BA Honours in Hotel and Catering Management there's a 12 week placement at the end of first year and a 30 week placement at the end of second year which are compulsory and a very important part of the course. Students can come in here and take a level 5 subject and go all the way as far as a master's at level 9 within this college. The students can join our courses on a part time basis or can join on a full time basis. Compared with other colleges in Ireland, we, we're quite successful and have quite a low dropout rate.